Today's topic, anemia, everything you need to know. Anemia is a health condition caused by a low amount of red blood cells. The red blood cells are responsible for carrying oxygen throughout the body, and a low count means that the body will lack oxygen and suffer from a lack of supply. Anemia is typically measured according to the amount of hemoglobin a person has in their blood. The protein is present inside red blood cells and combines with oxygen, changing it into something the cells can carry. The effects anemia has on the body are usually symptoms caused by a lack of oxygen. Anemia is believed to affect around 1.6 billion people around the world, with women and people suffering from chronic diseases being the most at risk. Let's look at this dangerous health condition in detail. Causes Blood cells typically have a lifespan of 100 to 120 days, and about 0.8 to 1% of them are replaced every day inside the blood. Folate, dietary iron, and vitamin B12 are required by the blood cells to mature. Any external or internal factor causing an imbalance in the development of blood cells is likely to cause anemia. Anemia usually results due to factors that may cause an overproduction of blood cells or rapid destruction of them. Factors that can increase red blood cell production include 1. Hyperthyroidism 2. Imbalance in iron, vitamin B12, and folate intake 3. Imbalanced production of red blood cells by the hormone erythropoietin Factors that cause red blood cell destruction include 1. Hemolysis 2. Childbirth 3. Endometriosis 4. Accidents 5. Surgery 6. Excessive uterine bleeding 7. Fibrosis 8. Cirrhosis 9. Liver and spleen disorders Symptoms People with anemia are usually pale and might complain of feeling cold. They can also experience dizziness, tiredness, problems in concentrating, dizziness, and unusual cravings. It can also affect the tongue, causing inflammation. In severe cases, anemia can lead to fainting. Other symptoms of anemia are 1. Jaundice 2. Low or high blood pressure 3. Heart murmur 4. Increased heart rate 5. Enlarged spleen, liver, or lymph nodes 6. Atrophic glossitis of the tongue Diagnosis Diagnosing anemia starts with a medical history and a physical examination. A family history of sickle cell anemia can make the diagnosis much simpler. Common tests to diagnose anemia include 1. A complete blood count, or CBC test, to determine the number of red blood cells in the body. 2. A ferritin test to look for iron stores. 3. Test for serum iron levels. 4. Vitamin B12 and folate test. 5. Stool test to check for occult blood. Treatment. Treatment for anemia depends on the cause. In case of a deficiency in iron, folate, or vitamin B12, you might have to take nutritional supplements. In more severe cases, a doctor might prescribe erythropoietin injections to stimulate red blood cell production. In cases where hemoglobin levels are too low, blood transfusions may be required. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.